Alright, good readings and salutations. My name is Comic Fire, and welcome back for more Devil Survivor 2 Record Breaker. Right, so let me show you what I did off screen. As you can see, I've got no Maka. <laughs> I got everybody some new stuff. We got Tobio Gag or Tobio Gagasin. I'm uh, pretty sure I had the Kikimori already. Jumbavan. Tom Lin, everyone's got some good stuff. I even got Elect Dance for the MC. All grinding free battles. I got everyone up to around 13. Eo is very strong because people, or rather demons, just kept going for her. Not quite sure what that was all about, but got a couple fairies and ghosts waiting in the wings. I'm probably just going to end up scrapping them soon because we don't really need them. So let me show you some stuff you can get in the action while I'm here. We can get pacifist made and be completely useless. Get stuff like Tobio and get Hairs of Inaba. Gold, uh, really, not a ton new, but you know, it's there. So, anyway, last time we saw a death video for our good old pal Keita. So, why don't we, uh, why don't, why don't we fix that, huh? Time to go into Demon Hacked. What you got, Joe? Isn't that the F gate? <laughs> Takes me back. That's uh, actually what us YouTubers uh, call this sensor thing we put over a swear word. That's not funny. I'm sorry. Uh, doesn't appear any of these options truly matter, so... Yep, the festival gate. Or F-gate, if you're in the know. Ooh. Um, F-gate? Joe, was that nickname really worth it to say two syllables? Absolutely. Totally. Anyways, it's an amusement park. Ah. I don't know. Why don't we check it out? There may be somebody in there. What are we thinking? Think? It looks pretty empty. Come on, let's go check. I gotta investigate Osaka anyways. If Kate is here, hey, bonus. That's simple, huh? I don't know. Kate didn't seem like the amusement park type. I don't know. All those angry short guys who just want to fight all the time sound like they could use, uh, could use the entertainment. Eh, if there's no one here, we'll just leave. Forward. Into the kingdom of dreams. <gasps> Can't remember if they said that at Disney or not. Hey, somebody is here. Called it. Oh, uh, wait. Demons. Definitely demons. <laughs> Some kingdom of dreams, right? Eh, tr nightmares are dreams, too. <clears throat> Shit, you good? Hey, that lady's surrounded by demons. We're coming to save you, miss. Please, you have to run. Come forth. Oh, she's doing this. <laughs> she's not being attacked. She's summoning the demons. Well, she kind of looks like she's playing piano, but... <laughs> Whatever, Gagason. I fought like eight of you recently. At a time. Leave her alone. What are we supposed to do then? If we can't attack her, we're gonna die. No, it'll be fine. I, I think Daichi's right. That's the only way. Desperate times and all that. We'll fight, but we can't let her die. Cool. Whatever, we just gotta undertale this. I'm sure we can find some way to uh do this uh, peacefully. Alright, so I cracked a lot of skills, might I add. Like, let's see, Daichi's got Fatal Strike, Snipe, Extra Cancel, Hero Aid, Fizz Up, and Poison. He's strapped for a physical attacker. Uh, so for passive skills, we've got stuff like Leader Soul, which I don't really feel the need to use. Everything's pretty much on anything else. Raiso isn't really useful, because we don't fight enough humans for it to really matter. I uh, always assigned to a team, so it's not like that matters. And I gave money bags over to Joe. No, I did. Gave that to me, because I like to fight. So, you know, stuff like that. Cool, so let's get our positions going. We got me over on the right. We'll send... Yeah, we'll send Joe that. Hmm. No, we'll send Joe this way. And you're coming with me. 
Ah, we should still try to crack these skills, huh? Let's see, Taunt... It's on her squad, so it's kind of hard to say. What about Anti-Curse? Also on the... Gemini. We'll kind of separate it, see what we can snag. Sure, it's gotta work eventually. <laughs> cool, so the main trick, you're gonna wanna head to the right side if you've got your electric user, because a lot of these guys are weak to electricity. And you're on the left here, we have people that are more weak to, well, Gagason's weak to force, but either way, I feel comfortable. Uh, it just started, man. Just <laughs> chill. We're gonna do just fine. I don't know, she kinda looked like a full-grown woman, but it's kinda hard to tell with the way Artistra baps in this game. Cool. Let's do it! <laughs> she seems sad. Well, she seems more tired than anything else, but I get that. Started working recently, so uh, I, f I feel tired, let me tell you. I understand tired. Now, Fatal Strike hits really hard, and it always hits, but it will never kill an opponent, so... Kinda gotta work with what you have. And we'll go for Zio on the Itsumare on the off chance that it'll paralyze it. Yeah, see, look at how strong that is. Oh, nice. Plus, Jambavan just hits like a dump truck anyway. Therefore, we can reliably just attack these guys and all shall be fine. Okay, well, maybe Itsumare should have used, or uh, Kikimori should have used it. Spell, but nope, we are good. Plus, now we get to show off Evil Wave, because we've got a dragon now, which means we can attack from a distance. Itsumade can do nothing in return to us. Now, on the downside, so long as we have a dragon on the squad, we are never allowed to get an extra turn. Like, there's just nothing you can do. There's no extra turns if you use a dragon or a vial. But it's fine, because, you know, you get to, uh, you get to hit really hard. From a distance, where no one can bug you. It's pretty great. Alright, now to show off a Lek Dance. You see, it eats up a lot of our MP. We only get to use this thing twice per skirmish, pretty much. Uh, yeah, Zan on the knocker. An extra cancel on Billwis. <laughs> get rid of that. Now let's see how a Lek Dance pans out. Alright, that was really bad. Electance has the chance to hit, you know, two to five times. I don't know the percentages of it hitting each one. It can't hit any opponent more... Or rather... It can only hit one opponent a max of, I believe, three times. But it can hit, you know, other enemies multiple times. It's... Kind of hard to control, so in a way, Mazeodyne is better if you know you can one-shot the entire squad. But as far as DPS goes, the dance skills is... Skills is... The dance skills are pretty much the best you're gonna get in Devil Survivor 2. It was pretty much the same way in Devil Survivor 1, too. But there are a lot more fun skills this time that you can play with as well, so it's not like... Dancing is the only way you're gonna get through the game. Not like the last game is like that, too, but... It helped. Mm, kind of wanted to use Dia on the MC, but no luck. I'm going to pop right there because it's not like the Phantasms uh, matter. I'm surprised we actually got a turn so fast. I think using Dragons, let's see, attack range is two. Oh no, it doesn't mess up your turn order. I think it's Vials that messes up your turn order. Ooh. Because Vials have a bigger hit range, but you can't move as fast, and I think your turn order gets screwed up. It's a pretty handsome face, not gonna lie. 
Cool. Let's go for Kikimura right away because I hate Dia. <laughs> it's uh, it's not fun. I don't want to deal with it. And we're going to drop an Elect Dance. Tobio can't use it quite as well because I don't think its magic is anywhere near as high as RMC, but... Hey, you know, every little bit counts. Plus fewer targets now. Yeah, see. Ah. I don't think having a dragon prevents you from canceling an opponent's extra turn. It just will never give it back to you. Can I get right up to this woman? Yeah, there's nothing you can do, which means it's time to attack! Uh, oh yeah, I have to hit the Makara on the right. So we'll go for Fatal Strike. I don't think we have to worry too hard. Ah, I should have spread this out. Or rather... No, 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 we, we, we've got this, never mind. I'm, I'm thinking too hard. We just have to, uh, see if we can't get that one Makara down in this one turn. Excellent! Cool, we'll send the MC up and then we can crack that center skill and all shall be well. It's just gonna take us a little time to get there, because, you know, we don't have a, uh... We don't have anyone with Phantasm. I just realized Devotion is kind of like White Wind in Final Fantasy. And no extra turn for you. Ah! Ah! My constant need to be a snarky asshole has cost me. But I got it back. Eat shit. Oh wait, I have... Beast speed, or devil speed, or wilder speed, or... Is this a wilder or a beast? I don't remember. Either way, it's Umade's no more. Yeah, that's a wilder, so I get devil speed, but... Don't get to use it right now. Kinda probably shouldn't be getting EO so powerful, but... Ah, what's the worst that happens? We need more strong women in video gaming. Uh, we'll just go for Zahn on this Kikimura. Ooh, 70 exactly. Ain't that satisfying. Alright, Gagason, go first and paralyze it. Well, we got sort of what we wanted. All things considered, I'm happy. Yeah, it's too bad we all kind of piled up on that one. I should have checked maybe if Joe could have also gotten that other taunt, but... It's not like it matters now. We'll get there, and that's what's important. But yeah, if we didn't grind last time, this fight would be much more difficult. I really thought I would take it out with that. But I suppose not. Can I... Constrict. When did I get hit by Constrict? Oh, the Makara car or the Makaras, rather. I'm sorry, I skipped past that too quickly. If you're quick on the K button, you can uh you can pause it. I might as well use Zio, it's not like she's gonna get another chance to move. Beep. Yeah, Fallen's a nice skill to have. It's not a reliable healing method, but it sure is a nice pick-me-up. You could also farm this fight if you wanted. I don't think that's a particularly good method of grinding, but... It's there if you wanted to have some extra, uh... Not extra music, but music you don't usually hear during the game. Don't know if I'd go for it, but it's there if you want it.
Let's make the Deitster stronger. I think we might as well. Uh, Kikimura as per the use. And one Zon for one Tom Lin. <laughs> Call that a Zon Lin, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, he knows what I'm saying. Kind of wish John Bavon got an extra, uh, extra strike, but I guess suppose beggars can't be choosers. Looks like I don't really need it with Fatal Strike. Because I know we're not big enough to hit it or knock an opponent down in one hit, but... We are strong enough to just make it count. Am I in range here? I'm not. I don't know, sometimes isometric, especially with the... Because I don't know if we can move the camera angle. So, sometimes I get a little confused. But I don't know, because some SMTs have been, always been a little weird with the camera angle. Well, I suppose if you really think about it, all SMTs are weird with the camera angle, especially in mainline, where a lot of it is, uh, first person. Excellent. You really can't beat that. Fortunately, Itsumades are no trouble anymore. So, let's finish this up. Well, I don't know about finish this up. That Makara might actually still be a stumbling block, because we can't hit it with Zeo. We can hit it with Aji, though. And Zon. I don't even know that's going to be enough. No, it'll be fine. I just feel like my physical attack isn't as reliably accurate as Agi, so we'll just go for that instead. Alright, gonna give a... Uh... Mm. That does put us in range to get a third Elect Dance. I'm gonna put it in magic for now. I'm not gonna set this for now, though. It's not as important to me. I don't think I can be damaged at this point, but just in case, because Fumi is going to get another turn before I get to. <laughs> Why'd I call her that? That's not. That couldn't be her name. Yes, yeah, her name. <laughs> She's in the, uh. She's in the OP, you know what's up. Stuck me with poison, though. Jerk. Well, actually, I suppose I didn't have to just sit there and end my turn. It now doesn't matter who gets the KO on Fumi. But you do have to persuade. Probably should have said this earlier. Uh, do persuade, you get more points towards uh, Fumi later on. Uh, I don't know, I feel like Zeo's like her stronger skill. Or, this animation comes out faster, so I think I like it more. I don't know if killing her technically is bad, but... I suppose we won't get a chance to find out. Oh, probably because we, when you get this low. No, I just got really unlucky there, huh? Well, everyone's 14 now, but... I don't know. I want Joe to get this. Joe seems like the type to beat women. Oh, it's Hustle, that's why, duh. I'm gonna say I have to land at least one of these, but... Yeah, see, it takes you just a 1 HP. That was an old Devil Survivor 1 standby, too. What in God's name? Okay, bye. Oh, we still have to deal with the Tsumade now. Okay. <laughs> it's weak to electricity. What's the worst I lose here? I don't know. I didn't figure it would make me do that. Thought we were done.
Poor Kikimura can't throw a punch with those spindly little arms of hers. Guess we aren't gonna get all the EXP in the world, but some is better than none. Or I could just miss and now we get none of the EXP in the world. Well, it's not like I had the MP for another CO anyway, so it didn't matter. This whole fight has just been a bunch of scattered disappointments. Yeah, see, caps out at 56. But with Poison Plus, I can inflict poison and the enemy can just die later on anyway. It's actually pretty cool. Boy, if I don't stop missing these physical attacks. Yeah, Daichi's gonna be fun. He almost leveled up again. We did it. Well, Eo almost did. That was a close one. Who was that lady? She didn't look quite right in the head. Well, that's not polite. She was possessed by a demon. Definitely. Messing around with machines in a place like this, then being whisked away by demons? Creepy. Daichi, that is victim blaming. Man, what is the deal? What the fuck? Nobody move. Huh? I'm on your side. So, you guys are the culprits. You're under arrest. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. We can talk this out. Wait a second. I've seen that face before. Hey, you're those kids who came with the chief. Y yes, that's right. Well, that doesn't make me it okay if I committed a crime. You can't just be nice to me. Beat me. The headquarters server was hacked a moment ago. Hacked? That can't be good. That was not Joe's line. Oh my gosh, they messed that up. It wasn't. We traced the signal's origin and followed it here. Did you see anyone? Well, actually... If Joe's voice came out of that, I would have laughed. A woman summoning demons, you say? Hmm. She's definitely our hacker. Remember, they charged 50 game... 50 dollars for this game at launch. This remake of a DS game. See? Told you we didn't do it. My apologies once again. We appreciate your cooperation. Um, about that woman? Something seemed odd about her. What do you mean? She seemed really out of it. Like she was being controlled by the demons. A human being controlled by demons? We've never heard of such a thing. Oh, that does not sound like even the most unbelievable shit we've heard today. We're serious. This freaky looking demon showed up and disappeared with the girl. Hacking, demons, and a mysterious girl. We'll need to investigate. Hold on, I'm getting a call from headquarters. Yes? If this is about the hack... More demons, understood. Send the coordinates, we'll handle it. I don't know why you're surprised about that. What? Hey, we weren't done. They're gone. We didn't get to ask them if they recognized the stairs in Keita's video. They're gone. We'll need to find someone else to ask. <sighs> at least we cleared up that misunderstanding. Yeah, at least we didn't get arrested again. Why'd they think that in the first place? They treated us like criminals. Whose idea was it to go to the F gate anyways? Seriously, crazy. Dude, this was your fault. Maybe. Anyways, <laughs> tell me about that girl the demons were controlling. Wacky, huh? But hey, new info, right? That's progress, baby. I, I can't believe you actually have the nerve to say that. And with that, we are done and can advance. So, next up, we're going to Rumors! Golly gee. I think it's just gonna be Osaka Park soon. Whoa. What is that? Osaka Castle. And all the other buildings, too. I can't believe it, but it's real, huh? I feel like we've had this epiphany like eight times now. Was Osaka in such bad shape too? Was this all from the same earthquake that hit Shibuya? Can one hit like that really cause all this damage? Mm-hmm. Tokyo and Osaka are on different fault lines after all. Yeah, I guess I could go for a malt, but what does that have to do with anything? I really wonder what that joke was in Japanese. <laughs> you shouldn't tease him like that. None of this really matters, so just keep going. He was talking about fault lines, Daichi. 
Japan is unusual in that it's surrounded by four tectonic plates. The pressure's intense. Over 2,000 active faults are in and around Japan, including the ones on the ocean floor. That must have fucking sucked before they people knew what fault lines were. Could you imagine just being, like, some fighter in, like, the Middle Ages and all of a sudden, like, just the world starts shaking over and over? Sorry, I'm totally lost. I was still thinking about milkshakes. Basically, there's no way one earthquake could wreck Tokyo and Osaka at the same time. Speaking of wrecked, the way we came wasn't too beat up. Weird. The city's taken a beating, but some parts of it don't seem affected at all. Could it be terrorism? That is odd. There was no one around, but some places aren't damaged. If it wasn't a quake, what else could cause this much damage? It was no quake. Oh. Huh, who's that? Who said that? Listen to me. That was no quake. <laughs> Who are you, old man? Don't touch me. Just, just back up, okay? Hey, what's wrong? You okay? <laughs> it's over. All over. This world is finished. Dust and gone. <laughs> oh. Finished? What's he talking about? The man's seen the end times. He's clearly crazy. Hit him with an elect dance and let's put him down. It's an earthquake. It's a war, they say. They're wrong. Dead wrong. <laughs> I've seen it. I've seen it with my own eyes. The world's collapsed. The final fall. We're all finished. Finished. <laughs> Alright, well, that's nice. <laughs> well then. Somebody's not playing with a full deck. What is that about? Ooh, good comeback. <laughs> Very nice though. <laughs> What do you think he saw? The end, apparently. Yeah, that it makes sense. I freaked out a little the first time I saw them, too. <laughs> we need to investigate some more if we want to find out what's really going on. We should hurry and find the spot from Kata's video, too. <laughs> wow, that sure was useless. Anyway. <laughs> on to Hard Bargain. left here after all. I don't know, those guys look kind of sketchy. Awesome. Let's go ask if they know about the place in the death video. Welcome. Come on down, boys. First come, first serve. Oh god, he's a gigolo. Um, excuse me, I wanted to ask something. Oh. Ooh. Oh, wow, there's a lot of stuff. Buy a lot and I'll give you the bulk discount. Man, do you think I need to buy something? You know, for asking? Maybe I'll just get some juice or something. Uh, what's this? The fantastic fusion of natural spring water and takoyaki puree. Yum. Oh, sweet merciful heavens. My stomach is churning just thinking about it. It's a popular item. That's our last one. Is it? What, seriously? Oh, man, I actually kind of want it now. What should I do? Oh, Daiji, don't, don't fall for well, it. You're better than that. All right, fine. I'll take it. Win in Osaka, right? Thanks. Your total will be 3,000 yen. 30 bucks? Well, okay. Let me just get three thousand. Three thousand. What? Three thousand yen? I could get the mega beef ball for that kind of shit. What's your problem? You should be grateful I'm even selling to you. That's gaslighting, I think. Oh, no, I, I think we pissed him off. It's okay, man. No need to push our luck. Well, what are you gonna do, kid? Make up your mind already. Uh, well, I don't exactly have 3,000 yen with me right now. Then quit manhandling the merchandise. Get out of here. Lousy window shoppers. All right, all right, sorry. Well, can we get a discount? Holy crap, baskets. That was terrifying. Osaka's a death trap. <sighs> scary place, scary time. Ugh. Oh, man. We didn't even get to ask about the death video. What do we do? I wonder what that would, well, I've never even had takoyaki. I can't even imagine what the puree would taste like. Anyway, we're moving on to Osaka Woman. Oh, by the way, Daiichi with the street vendor there for hard bargain gives you plus 10 to Daiichi. All right, so on to Osaka Woman. Hey, look, they're still at it. Come on down, my prices can't be beat. Well, that's just untrue. 
Can't believe he's saying that. It's totally false advertising. Well, I don't know. Is anyone else selling water with takoyaki puree? That really is like you can't be beat if you're looking for a price on that because no one else is selling someone it. Someone would just stand up to him. We've got demons. Me? You kidding? No way. Just summon Tom Lin. Hit him with the Zan. I'm just gonna wait for karma to get him. Shopkeepers in Osaka are scary. Tokyo guys like you and me should just walk away. That's pussy shit. Three thousand yen? Are you out of your gourd? Uh, <laughs> woman. Put a shirt. Too bad. It's this crazy world we're living in. Now you're also in the OP, so I wonder what's up here. Too bad. What the hell are you talking about? Are you stupid? Huh? Did you just call me stupid? <laughs> Fight. It's because times are so tough that we have to help each other. Isn't that right? Shut up, lady. I got a business to run. I have a reputation. A reputation for being a heartless thief. Oh, damn. You're taking advantage of people in hard times. Is that the reputation you want? Man's got a cigar. He doesn't care about the common man. Uh, 100 yen should be enough to get anything on this table. What? 100 yen? At least add in sales tax. Sales tax? Take the money and be grateful. I'm out of here. Thanks for the drink. Hey, not the Takayaki spring water. Wow. <laughs> Get fucked. Forget what I said before. It's not Osaka shopkeepers that are scary. It's Osaka women. This sucks. I feel so violated. I actually feel kind of bad for the guy. Let's leave him alone. Eh. Karma got him. Cool, so our next battle is in Never Say Die. So, let me uh, just check to see how things are going here. Alright, cool. Uh, let's save real quick, just in case this gets a little too hard. Though I think we're still pretty well off. It didn't offer us any new demons, so I don't think we're it's going to be too hard. So, I say we go for it. Then we have plenty of Manka now if we really wanted to fuse one off. Ebisu Bridge. Nothing out of the ordinary, except that it's freaking empty. We'll never figure out where that death video takes place at this rate. We have to keep trying gives you plus two to Keita. Mm-hmm. Panicking won't help us find anything. We just gotta be patient and keep looking. <laughs> Monsters! Boy, that was a real good scream. Did you guys hear that? Monsters? <laughs> we should check it out. Yeah, if somebody's under attack, we need to help them. Out of the way, coming through. Oh, hey, you. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, jeez. Are you okay? Gives you plus two to EO. Yes, I think so. Who was that? She was heading towards the screen. Is she trying to rescue people? That's really dangerous. She's probably going up against demons. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> Whoa, we're going too? Yeah, why not? Help! Somebody! I don't want to die! Demons, get out of here. I'll handle this. What, we're just gonna classify her by that, not redhead woman? Oh, hey. No! You, you made more monsters, but you're a human. Relax, I'm on your side. Leave those pesky demons to me. <laughs> How can I trust you? Because we're here too. She's a demon tamer? I really did not see that one coming. She's fine. We can just let her handle this. <laughs> Come on. Hey, stay back, you guys. You need to run. Believe now we're cool and gives you plus one. Huh? You're demon tamers too? My name is Hinako Kujo. I'm gonna help these people escape. Give me a hand. Oh no, you got it gives you plus one. Either of the other two works. Y yeah, we have to save these people. By the way, this woman's joining our squad in case the OP wasn't enough to uh, warn you, so. We have to make sure those innocents get out safe. Let's do 
it. We can protect everyone. The people running, and that girl trying to save them. <laughs> Vamanos, amigos! It's pretty much Let's Mosey, isn't it? Uh, but that's not Japanese. We're gonna save everybody, so make sure not a single person falls to those demons. Okay, but it's dangerous to fight alone. We should work to... Yeah, she's not listening. <laughs> This is a very good bit of delivery. Anyway, Hinako can't die, the civilians can't die, so we gotta be real careful with this. Fortunately, no skills to crack, so we're already doing pretty well. Let's see, we're gonna send... Hmm. We're gonna send Joe out in front, as well as the MC, and these two are gonna clean up the back. Not too worried about Hinako. I'm sure she can take care of herself, but I want those civilians nice and safe. So we're going to put us a firm barrier in between the demons and them. Kind of wish those lines were voiced. I'd be interested to see what uh, kind of cadence he had. That one I can imagine exactly what she would sound like, so I'm not too bummed about missing it. Come on, Joe. That's enough, uh, that's enough references out of you. Yeah, see, with Devil Speed, you gotta be real careful here. Boy, Bilbo does not have much MP to spare, huh? I just looked and noticed it had seven. Not much at all you can do with that, actually. Let's see. Kind of resistant, but we can still always freeze, so I'm always down for that. As well as a Zeo. Ow. I was about to say try. You want to proc counter again? I can hear my neighbor's dog just going ape shit over there. I wonder what's going on. Oh no, Gag's in. You're in trouble. Though I don't think you're in range of the other demon, so I think he'll be fine. Oh, I know. That's a flight demon. We're probably going to lose Gagason. Oh no, it's going right for Daiji. Cool. But I don't know. It's kind of why I don't like small dogs. All they do is scream. Like, come on. You do, do, do literally anything else. Alright, whatever. You, you want to throw Zahn's out? I've got Zahn. I've got your Zahn. What you gonna do without that ogre, huh? What's that? You'll do nothing? That's what I thought, fool. Hmm. Get fucked. Of course, Jambavan doesn't have much MP to spare either. Get us some Jamba Juice, you know what I'm saying? Boom, whole squad roasted, eat shit. But another one right away, huh? Oh, Devil Speed. Uh, yeah, that's not as uh, well off as I would hope, but we'll take what we get. Actually, I think we should take on the hair of Inaba here because that can double speed and start hitting the civilians, and I don't want that. Kind of want to just form an impenetrable barrier where they're just going to have to keep breaking themselves against us. Uh, yeah, let's throw out a Lek Dance. I don't think we particularly need it, but... No, no, it could, it could pan out. Eh. We'll take it. And you know what else we'll take? Uh, a nice helping heaping of Dia, because, yeah, yikes. Boom, back in the fray. Get ready to go down. Itsumade. Physical attack. Physical attack. Zio on the Itsumade. 
yeah, we're kind of getting to the point where we really can just... Oh, eat shit. Kind of got to pick and choose where I want to take out here now. I get Kikimura for more EXP, and I'm all about that. And not really too concerned about what an Itsumade can do alone. Because I don't think those civilians are going to get there anywhere near fast enough. I kind of don't want them all picking on Joe, but... At least he's doing better than he could be. Ooh, I got just enough P for another Elect Strike. Or Elect Dance, rather. So I'm going to go for it. If I live long enough to be able to take advantage of it. Eh, one extra turn gone. Tobio, you did your best and you did what's important. So let's sweep these hairs of Inabas out of here. Let's sweep some hair, my fellow, uh, hair enthusiasts. I don't know. I tried to say hairdresser, and I just, I ruined it. What you, oh no, you resist that. Probably should have just physically attacked. Don't know why I had it in my mind that he didn't, but it's not like it mattered. <laughs> I was thinking I was looking at the ZO, uh, the electricity resistance. Back up to full you go, Gagasin. Or, not full, but closer to full. What are we thinking? Wipe that out. Hmm. I kind of want to actually stay still, because I don't want that hair of Inaba to, uh... Because that'll get to move before anyone else. And if I move, it's right in the way of that. I'd have to be able to kill it in one shot. Which I don't doubt I'd be able to do. Or I might be able to just go straight through. I'm gonna just KO it here, because I don't think the other ones can reach the other demons in time. I think it's just more important that we, uh, finish this. But I kinda wanna save my MP for more elect dances, because I've only got three charges and I wanna make sure that they count. I don't think that the civilians will die in one demon attack, but better safe than sorry. I'm not ultimately too concerned. I mean, how we should probably be worrying about Hinako, huh? You're trying your best, but uh, you're not gonna succeed. Of course, you put Kikimura in a bad way, so... In a way, you did succeed. I'm proud of you, Itsumade. I... should have gotten out of the... Because I'm so used to being able to just attack wherever. That was not smart on my part. It really isn't a matter of being smart, it's just a matter of I forgot I had an option, so I didn't take it. Plus, it's looking uh, more like more and more like. Oh, I was gonna say it's like it's not gonna matter, but Fatal Strike was never going to kill. Weird flex, but uh, okay. <laughs> I'm making you wait. Get closer just in case the demon attack happens. Oh yeah, she's handling herself just fine. Yeah, I don't want these guys too far off, just because I don't know quite what happens if another demon's about to drop in. So, guess who'd rather not worry about that? It's me. Farewell. Yeah, and Joe's had more than enough. This is, uh, this is my Bill Wiss now. Probably check to see if we can get a better Wilder soon. I think Hair of Inaba is going to outrun its usefulness. 
Oh no, it just ends when you take out the demons. Okay, wonderful. Cool, now we can start pumping up agility a bit. Am, am I safe? Oh, thank you. Thank you. You saved my life. You could sound a little more excited, not gonna lie. Uh, are they all gone? You really were on our side. Thank you so much. I gotta find out who voiced her, because she is putting her all into it. Ooh, they made it out alive, and so did we. All right, good day. Not bad. Hey, you guys were awesome. Ah, you scared me. It's cool, Benji. Demons are all gone. It's cool. Are you guys with the people in yellow who were fighting the demons? You could say that. Yellow? Oh, it's actually more Oriolan, but whatever. <laughs> Anyway, uh, say that, uh, uh, hold up, I'm out of here. Uh, say Gyps, and it's plus one to Hinako. Yeah, those guys. Is that what the weird logo on their uniform says? Gyps? Do we ever find out what Gyps stands for? I forget. Ah, okay, I, I guess we are part of Gyps, kinda. More like we know people who are. Really? Can you introduce me? I want to join up. I, I don't know if we're open taking applications right now, but you can always throw in an internship application. You say you want to join, but we're not really official members either. You're not? Well, then who are you guys? Yeah, that. We're just ordinary guys and a lady who came along with the Gyps Chief. Yeah, we're just, uh, we're more like mercs, I'd say. Kind of like contractors. Hmm, that's so? Okay. Can you introduce me to the Chief then? Well, shit, are we... Can we be considered contractors? We're not getting paid. Sure, that wouldn't be a problem. I'm getting room and board, right? That's Wait, what? You want to meet him? Why not? I can use demons. I'd be a big help. Um, what do you think, man? It'll be fine. Gives you a plus one to Hinako. Really? You sure he won't go ballistic on us? What's he gonna do? Sick demons on us? <laughs> Excellent. Oh, were you guys heading somewhere else first? I could show you around. Oh, hey, uh, now that you mention it, it's Hinako, right? So, do you know any huge stairs? Like, I don't know, where a guy might fall and die? Taichi. Hmm, stairs big enough to kill a guy? Just, what are you planning? N nothing, I, I can explain. Give me a sec, I'll show you. What? This is a death video! Sure is! Where's this kid now? There's no time for chit-chat! He could die if you don't hurry! I don't know, we've been looking for like an hour and a half and have had two battles. He might already be dead. Please, calm down. That's why we're asking if you knew where the stairs were. Okay, sorry. I didn't mean to flip out. Those are the stairs at the Bickman entrance. No two ways about it. Huh. Holy crap, something actually went our way. Now we know where to go. This might even work out. Well shit, looks like we can save Keita then. Wait, Bickman? That's where we're meeting him. This must happen around 1430. Okay, then we're safe. Meeting him? Is this kid a friend of yours? If friend is a strong word. His name's Keita Wakui. He's working with Gyps, too. We're supposed to meet up with him so he can show us to Gyps headquarters. Gyps headquarters? Now we're talking. We gotta save this kid. All right, we'll take it. Huh? Does that mean you're coming with us? <laughs> Welcome to the party. Anywho, we know where to go now, so let's get going. You're right. Let's find Keita and warn him. To Bickman, then. We gotta hurry and find this Keita kid. As if I could cross the city, can we run there in an hour? Anyway, Hinako is now in the party. We can arrange her as we please. <laughs> so, let's give her a look, see. Now, it doesn't really uh, look like a... Uh, she's very well-rounded right now. I think she ends up specking more towards, like, agility and magic. Pretty sure it's agility. Though I also think it might just be agility and strength, which is also kind of how Daichi is specking right, specking right now, but I think more specialized. I don't quite remember. She's pretty good. I end up usually dropping Daichi for her, partially because I think her stat distribution works better for endgame skills, and partially because she got damn titties, though. Alright, so, <laughs> I'm joking. It's the red hair. I like redheads. Uh, so, uh, I think now's as good a time as any to call it an episode. We could... Hmm... I might end up throwing Hinako in and exchange for Daichi, just because he's... I'd say he's kind of slacking, but you know what we could do? There, now we don't have to worry about it. <laughs> See, it all panned out! Everything's coming up comic! 
All right, but now seems like as good a time as any to end the episode. So thank you so very much for watching me. Hope you enjoyed. And next time, let's see if we can't save Keita. <laughs> see you guys then.